got my coffee. So, I kind of wanted to make a video about why I haven't really been making videos for like the past month. Um, I'm actually getting ready to go to a tattoo appointment right now. So, I kind of had to do that because I don't want to be late and I have an hour to get done. But, I haven't really been here. <clears throat> Earlier last month, I got my wisdom teeth out. And that kind of put me down for like a week. And my face was a little swollen. So, I didn't really do much. I didn't really want to make any videos just because my face was swollen and the week after that I had jury duty for the first time ever not exciting I only had to go one day because I was lucky enough to be on the backup jury service but it was not exciting and then another thing too I really didn't watch that many movies all month. I mean, I went and saw Unfriended Dark Web and The First Purge twice, but that was about it. I didn't really do much beside that. And I didn't really feel like I needed to make, I don't know, I just wasn't in the mood, the creative headspace to make a video, a review about anything. It's my birthday next week and I don't know last night I was just feeling kind of inspired to sit down and make a little video and I'm gonna make like a little tattoo vlog which is great I was also thinking last night about how I want to change up how I do movie reviews and I was just getting sick and tired because it was kind of just like the same thing over and over and over again but yeah, I want to do something different. Different. <clears throat> I haven't really thought of what, but I really like watching more in-depth reviews that spoil it. I don't know if that's like unpopular or what, but I might start doing that if I really enjoy a movie or I really strongly dislike it. Because I want to do more than just... I mean, I can always do a spoiler-free review, review for the first part of it. So that way, you know, like if people don't want to watch after that, that's fine. But I just really want to talk more in depth about movies instead of just like surface level. I also wanted to go see Unfriended Dark Web again because if you saw my review on Letterboxd, this is literally like almost em like completely empty but I'm not buying another one so I'm trying to use it up because you know, dark. If you saw my review on Letterboxd about Unfriended Dark Web, you'll know how much I loved it and it makes me kind of sad that it didn't get the a lot of people didn't go and see it so it kind of flopped and I really I don't know how well the first one did but I really enjoyed this one so much better and I think I'm gonna make a whole video about it but I might wait until it comes out on DVD so I could like sit down and really go through it but I really enjoyed it and I mean, the first purge was okay, and I might go and make a review for that too because I feel like I know it like the back of my hand and I have some valid complaints about it, but I might do, like once the show starts, I might do a little thing about that, maybe like, I don't think I could handle doing a video per week about each episode, but maybe like every couple episodes I'll do one I know I'm just kind of rambling right now but that's just the headspace I'm in <laughs> so sorry if you don't like that you actually don't care about me doing my makeup either it's just kind of a good time for me to 
I forgot to put concealer on my nose. It's a good time for me to just like sit down and talk and like since I have time right now to do that. I do want to make change to the channel. I don't want to just give up on it. Um, I'm also going to release this little maybe like seven or eight minute short film I did a couple months ago. I've been procrastinating that all summer and I haven't worked on it at all. And I wanted to get it out back in July. And I just have this thing where like if something's not perfect, I don't want to release it. And I really just need to get over that creative fear because nothing is going to be perfect and people still aren't going to like your stuff even if it's perfect to you. But yeah, no, I have a bunch of things coming up and I'm really excited for Halloween. I just want to do something different and I don't want to get tired of like doing the same thing all the time. And I know it's hard having like a channel about multiple things but I'm hoping people will understand because that's just where I am right now. I want to change up my review format. I want to get back in it. I forced myself to watch two movies yesterday and I don't really know how I feel about them. Um, if you saw my letterbox once again you'd understand. I don't know I just want to get back out there make some videos so for my tattoo appointment today it's kind of like an early birthday present to myself super excited i wanted to make one a uh, tattoo video last month too since i went and got my right elbow ditch tattooed there it is <laughs> but i just wasn't feeling it and i feel bad for not saying anything and that i was going to take a break but I kind of just need to do that sometimes. Leo. I am changing the channel a bit. Still, I mean, I obviously still love horror movies, like, you know, but, excuse my nails, waiting to paint them for next week. Still gonna do reviews. Definitely gonna do more, like, adventure-y, vloggy videos like I have before. And I feel not bad, but I wish I took videos when I went to Gettysburg last month because it was amazing. I did take a bunch of pictures with my nice camera, but that was about it. A ton of stuff this month for, like, I'm celebrating my birthday a couple times, like, with my family and then friends and then other friends. And going to Philly. And then I'm going to the... Um, Monster Mania Con, which is like a horror convention in Cherry Hill. That's the day after my birthday. I'm super excited for that. I've never been to a horror convention, so like, I feel like I'm in a better headspace because I'm doing so much stuff this month, if that makes sense. Like, I want to go out and I want to make videos, just little tiny things with my friends and like, to vlog my experience with Monster Mania Con. So as I was saying, I know it's not everyone's cup of tea, vlogging and stuff like that, but I don't know, I just want to try something different. I have a lot of things planned out for, I was going to say Halloween, Halloween and just October in general. So I just, I'm like in my prime right now, like as soon as August 1st hits, I'm like Halloween. I'm actually getting like a Halloween tattoo today, so you guys will see that in my next video. Thanks for sticking around if you're actually like if anyone's even watching this. But yeah, sorry I just kind of ranted for probably 10 minutes. Not even a rant, just saying the same shit over about what I want to do with this channel. But yeah, uh, I don't know, leave your suggestions below if you have any about videos you'd like to see that I mean I want to do like more lifestyle videos since um I went completely vegan again which is fun I'm also I don't want to go completely zero waste 
but I'm also kind of doing that a little bit. So I've made some like lifestyle changes. Um, I've really been on my skincare too. I'd love to do a video about that even though I'm obviously not a professional and my skin's still not the best. But it's definitely gotten better and I have like before and after photos of what it used to be like before and you can clearly see in the photos how bad my skin used to be. Thanks for sticking around if you've actually stuck around for this long.